my name is Pedro Pena Bastos. Uh, I'm the Spurão restaurant chef. And today we're making uh, lightly smoked and cured mackerel uh, with tangerine, cucumber and marjoram. It's underrated. It's a really nutritious and gorgeous fish in terms of flavor and really versatile. And you can actually do quite a lot of things with it. And fish is a, it's a big part of our culture and we must give them a higher value, you know, and doing preparing mackerel, which is a really cheap and accessible fish for everybody. Typically pre preparing in Portugal we have we have many ways uh, from the lemon cured, the, it's the most common one. Uh, some people do it with vinegar, uh, some people just um, grill them under charcoal. But here we, we lightly cure, the, cure them. Okay, and we do a uh, really fresh marinade with vinegar and some water, some salt. We cover it with, with salt, coarse salt, during half an hour and then with vinegar and uh, the vinegar brine. And then we remove the skins, we remove the bones and we have uh, this little perfect filling. It will hold up to three days in the fridge, so actually it keeps some freshness. And I'm just gonna slice it, approximately one inch. And here we have some uh, fish oil. If you get mackerel, you can ask for the bones and then just quickly pan sear them and put in some container with, with some oil and the day after you filter it and you have your fish oil. And then we hydrate the skin. We let this rest in here, okay? And then we, we're going to prepare the, the cucumber tartare. I'm gonna start to slice and I'm just gonna use the the middle slice. Okay, we let season it with, with salt, okay, and some lemon juice. And we leave it to rest for about 10 minutes. And meanwhile, we have the, we already peeled the, the tangerine segments, and we're just putting some oil on it. You can use fish oil. We're gonna prepare the tartare with diced cucumber. Here we have a mixture of homemade yogurt and some creme fraiche. We're gonna add some fried shallots, okay, some sea salt, and some codium powder, which is a seaweed powder. We have sesame oil and some lemon juice. We're gonna stir it quite well. Our cucumber roll, okay. We don't want too much quantity. It's gonna give some nice texture. Okay, it's crunchy, it's umami, and it cuts the fishy flavor. Now we have all our components of the dish, so we're now ready to sear the mackerel, okay, to blowtorch the mackerel, and then we're gonna plate. We do it slowly inside of the kitchen. The skin release, slowly release the oil, and it doesn't burn like straight away. To finish our dish, we have a couple of extra ingredients. One of them, it's a uh, nori and miso emulsion, okay? It's basically a mayonnaise. But we, we start with egg yolks and oil and some Dijon mustard, some lemon juice, really easy. And then we add some homemade miso, okay? Some garlic and some nori powder, which is a seaweed, okay? Some citrus powder, just to create a nice aroma to the dish. You're gonna use some codium powder as well. And now you're ready to put our mackerel, okay? Sea salt on top. Just place it here. We have some extra elements. We have some tangerine gel. It's made with, uh, with gelatin, really simple, just really great tangerine juice from fresh tangerines. I'm gonna use the fried shallot again. Okay, we, we add some tangerine segments to it. We're gonna prepare the last ingredients, which is uh, tangerine and marjoram vinaigrettes. This is made with sesame oil, some organic olive oil, some colza oil, lemon juice, and marjoram oil. We're gonna just put the flowers, some nasturtium leaves, the vinaigrette that we made. Uh, we like to serve it on the side. So thanks so much for watching. We are here at Brown Restaurant in Portugal and I leave you with a smoked mackerel.